I don't believe this is the end of the game. But it could be the end of the game. You know, maybe I don't actually have the teleporter for this. I mean, that's why I couldn't teleport here. Alrighty. I mean, if we're going here, unless... Unless there's something else involved, which there could be. This, this feels like it. Does it look like a final dungeon though? I don't really know. I'll have to see what, what it looks like on the inside. Cora, you're okay. <laughs> Darian. And here I thought you <laughs> deserted again. What happened? We underestimated their defenses. This is no mere tower. We know. We're here to put an end to whatever this monster is doing. Good. Cora. We know that this doppelganger has something to do with you. That you're some kind of... Chosen one. Chosen by the gods. I gotta rewrote that. You know, chosen one of the gods. This information has no bearing on your mission. All of this is happening because you refused the doppelganger. It was supposed to do something to you. Give you some kind of mission. Do something that will fix everything down here. We need to know what he asked you. It's not... Your business. Not our business? Sills in there, Cora, along with countless other innocent people. We are the ones going inside to fix your mess. So don't tell us it's not our business. Look at this tower. Do you know what it's for? It's a Venati relic, a well of unfathomable power. I don't know how or why, but he intends to use it for destruction and nothing else. We already know that. Then you already have your answer. You know what the doppelganger asked me to do. To betray Harrion. Fine. Keep your secrets. We're going to do it either way. Darian. Good luck. I really wish he told us. There... There's no way I'm going to let it in this way. And if... If you want to be a party member, we can heal you. I have Game Pass. I do not. I try to stay away from subscription services that... I'm not actively using. I survived the corrosion, so I might as well survive this. The, the exception being Nintendo Online, because it's $20 a year. <laughs> I'm a poor sucker fool and I can afford $20 a year. Hmm. Well, you know, I could have tested that one thing again. That would have been a nice thing to test. Laser beam. Wait, next wave. Okay.
Why are you so fast? Uh, I feel like I'm... Oh yeah, I'm, I'm waiting for you. Where are you? There you are. Ah, they're spawning from platform. good chunk of HP. Sure, let's go this way. We'll, we'll send you over there to, to help out. Uh, you guys don't have very much HP. I will say, though, that Game Pass does have a lot of games that I would definitely be interested in, uh, yeah. in playing. It has Gears Tactics on it. And uh, I'd rather not spend... well, it was $60. No, not sixty dollars. I mean, you are taking a million years to cast this. This is going to be a good spot. Yo, why are you so slow? All right, that trap orb. Attacking. Hey. Weaken you guys a little bit. And then siphon orb. Proceeding. Here. And uh, let's advance time. Get some more energy here. the Thea train right now. Time. 
looked easier that way. Okay. Let's work on this squad. Thoris. Right. Uh, oh, I keep activating their their watch. We'll call it. Okay. Let's target these guys. Attacking. Can't target the people that I want to. A prayer for your wayward soul. Oh, I thought I attacked the wrong target. Life is hard. Uh, tomorrow's Astrial Ascending gets released? I have no idea what that is. What, what is Astrial Ascending? What turn is it? Let's put you over here. Sometimes I'm out of the loop on on the video games. Only sometimes. Darkness before dawn. Okay. Advance until Thea's turn, which we will put a trap orb here. And we will just wait out the turns. Okay. Oops. I'll switch characters. I need to figure out. Proceeding. What kind of shenanigans there actually are in this. Wait, did you cast it on yourself again? Why does one of those guys look like a top dog? Huh. There's different kinds. Never noticed. Okay. There. Keeps defaulting to the spell. Okay. Uh, what battle system is this? This is its own uh, unique battle system. Go ahead and do that. I wouldn't say net. Well, it's it's a very familiar battle system, uh, but it has like a uh, like a a tactics kind of take on it. You know, you can move your characters around and exploit weaknesses in that fashion. Um, can I find a way? No. Uh, do I like it? I I would say that the criticism I have of the battle system is that it just it doesn't really 
do anything with the battle system. If that makes sense. You know, it it looks cool. There's a lot of uh, a lot of possibilities here, but I don't feel like any of those possibilities are explored, really. Uh, this should kill you. An orb. Attacking. This could get crazy. This could get really crazy. Okay. I don't know how I want to handle this. Oh, they're the same name. Oh, wait, no, they're not. So I would want to take care of these guys more than I would want to take care of the other guys. Or is it Celine? about this. I want to know how much energy generation I actually have. Proceeding. That was what, seven, seven thousand? Not going to get much energy out of all this, regrettably. You know, it's kind of funny that this that this specific scenario makes Thea really good, but otherwise she's just kind of whatever. Oh, what if I put the traps? Well, it seems like the traps last forever. It would take her forever to get over there, though. What if I just placed more traps? Attacking. It's like their buff is gone. I can't really tell if there are more traps there. Attacking. Man, just imagine traps on all four platforms. Energy for days. Uh, what kind of room is this? Is this what Oberos has been doing? Trapping these people inside crystals. The ones he didn't sacrifice, at least. Why would he do that? To protect them from impending doom, maybe? But what is he going to do with them afterwards? It doesn't matter. We're going to stop him. I've already seen this kind of cell. We must press on. Have you come to weave your web of lies again? You're too late. There's nothing you can do anymore. My triumph is inevitable. See, the god machine is sated. 
And soon I will be able to erase the consequences of your decades of treachery. From where does this newfound confidence come? From the moment I assumed the form of both of your pathetic and misguided champions, everything became clear to me. You're playing against impossible odds, with barely any chance of success. I am willing to risk everything for mankind's right to true freedom. Then tell me, what good did mankind accomplish up until now that you feel is worth defending? I understand that the corrosion is fair punishment for your immeasurable sins. Hope, you see, is a human thing. You wouldn't understand. Is that why mortals and humans are squandering the world that was bequeathed to them? I am not interested in understanding the workings of immature human minds. What you call hope and thirst for freedom, I call greed. None of that matters anyway. Soon I will erase mankind's history. So many millennia of aimless wandering. Start anew in a purified world, with the gods free, and humanity humbled at last. The survivors, I will make them beg on bloodied knee, until they realize how good the gods have been to them. And once their spirits are remolded, and their children set on the right path, mankind will experience its golden era. An era of obedience. I will have all the time in the world to teach them. And you are powerless to stop it. Me? Maybe. <laughs> Perhaps you were hoping that the Bear of Destruction would prevent me from carrying out my plan. The thought may have crossed my mind. This will not happen. That boy will be broken before he even sets foot in here. Don't underestimate him. Regardless of his inexperience, he is the only man on Herion who can withstand the Seed of Destruction. If by some strange occurrence his spirit carries him this far, I will crush what remains of it. Now, in your last moments, behold how a world built on delusions comes to an end. Oh dang. Did Syl get sacrificed? Or did she get, uh, crystal? The world may never know. Let's uh, mark.